Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula, a flat and jungled region of 200 square kilometers, home to over 4 million people. 16% of this region's population live in rural settlements where both water and electricity are precious commodities. When it rains, the dirt roads here become impossible, so we can be left with no clean water for many days. Water from the well is bad, and many of us get sick from drinking it, but we have no other choice. For Rosa, the lack of a dependable water supply forces her family to drink from their ground well, where the water is brackish, dirty, and harbors waterborne disease. An engineering student at the state capital's university, Jonathan Gual, saw the same problems during his work in these remote communities. His solution, a water purifier that harnesses the region's intense sunlight. Water quality is equal to quality of life, and the life these people lead is entirely alien to existence in urban areas. Seeing that such basic problems remain an issue in parts of my state made me very motivated to help. Jonathan's water purifier works by exploiting what he says is Yucatan's 4.5 kilowatt hours of daily sunlight, enough to power 75 regular light bulbs to evaporate and condense water on a slanted glass roof, which then runs off, purified, into a storage tank. Despite the abundant rainfall here in the Yucatan, drinking water is not always available from the main supply, and bottled water is too remote and expensive for these rural communities. A water purifier that requires no electricity would greatly improve the region's quality of life. The machine can produce six litres of purified water a day, enough for a family of three. Gual's purifier remains in its prototype stage, but he hopes it will soon see full-scale production. We are working on a larger model which will be able to produce double or triple the amount of clean water that it is currently capable of, and therefore be able to meet the requirements of these families. While these remote communities are devoted to preserving their Mayan traditions, Jonathan's renewable purifier would provide a much appreciated 21st century upgrade. Alistair Babastock, CGTN, Merida, in Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula.